everybody. I'm Song and this is my Lego house. So, I'm starting in my garden. In my garden, I have a pool. A quite big one, in fact. So, we have a lovely waterfall thing shooting out of the pool. Two little chairs and an umbrella that you can have some drinks or eat some food in the pool and you just want to chill. Next to the pool, we have a hot tub. And in the hot tub are my two good friends, Sienna and Natasha. Now, that's our pool. And we will love, and this is our well-loved slide. I will try out the slide in one minute. Ready, three, two, one, and I'm stuck. Whee! <laughs> Splash into the water I want. Okay, now we're off to my kitchen where, where I love to cook for my lovely kids. Now, in this video, my kids will not be here. But you may see them in another. Here we are in my kitchen. <clears throat> in this video, you will see that I have a couple of pets hanging around, playing and doing whatever they do. So, in the kitchen, for some of my pets, I have food bowls. I own a baby bear, which means I'll have to have some fish. I have a chinchilla, which would love some carrots. And I have a dog, but I need to get the dog biscuits. So let me just refill that. There. Now we have the dog biscuits. This is where we have food. So, the old... The older kids, they eat at this table. Well, me and my husband eat at this table. And we have a bunch of baby chairs, which we don't use much. And my birthday cake with a sink. And a popcorn machine which says lemonade. And there is lemonade right there. A bottle of lemonade. And we have real real Lego popcorn in there. Open that up. See? Now we have some delicious popcorn we can eat every single day. This is our cabinet and our stove. We don't have a very, very big kitchen, but we work with what we have. Inside the cabinets we have just some kitchen utensils. Inside these boxes are just some food and some, well, more utensils that we don't have room for. For example, this cupcake thing. And here's the filling of the cupcake. Here's the cupcake. So that's our kitchen. Here's a quick view of our kitchen. Oh, and one more bit, which is over here. If you can see, there's a little window, which is a little doggy flap. For our dogs, you will see you later. And here's the door to the backyard. We don't have a living room, so we like to spend our time outdoors. And in the outdoors, we have a Christmas tree since it's getting close to Christmas. It's a very large Christmas tree compared to me. And we have a lovely barbecue over here, which my husband may demonstrate. Right now, my husband is cooking nothing. <laughs> Right now, I am in our go-kart track. 
Here we have two go-karts. A pink one and a blue one, which my daughters both use. Here's a demonstration. So all you do is, oh, pick yourself up. And try to get yourself on there. And just get yourself pushed. And don't run into walls like I just did. Went. All right. Now the go-kart will leave without me. That was a bit of a go-kart fail. So let's move on to the next thing. This is kind of a multi-space. In this area, we have many different things, as you can see, including all our bikes, motorbike, another motorbike, well, a scooter, bicycles, a blue one, and a yellow, which are all usable. Me and my family use them quite often. And we have this pink and yellow big thing. Now, it's a tent. So, the flaps of this, like the flaps or the sides are coming out a bit, so we could so we should probably tuck them in, but I need them to come out because I'm going to take them apart. Anyways, so if you looked over, so my daughters, we both use this. A pink bed and a blue bed for when they want to have like a little chill out time outdoors. Like I said, we don't have a living room, so we love to spend our time outdoors. So you can see better, I have removed the tent. So here I have a slide with trees to make stairs. And we have a little waterfall and a little tiny slide. We really don't know what we use it for, but it's quite interesting. And a little, little step ladder to climb up. Whee! And... Wait, I need some help. Oh, there we go. We, I was of course going to demonstrate the slide because it's amazing. Let's move on to the next area. One of my favorite parts of the house is the stables where we ride the horses and, well, the Pegasus that we own. We own two different species of horse Pegasus kind of things. We have a yellow and pink one and a purple and white one which has fallen down which my husband is feeding so this thing right here this yellow thing it's an attachment that you can attach to the yellow one which the yellow horse which would make it have wings like a pegasus here's one wing <laughs> with the saddle connected on and there's the other Trying to get the saddle back on. And we have a couple of like different types of weird mushroom flower thingies. And this little vine like cascade of beautifulness. That's not a word. And a little tree some, and a rock with a little pond. Oh, and these things are food and water troughs. So this is the water trough. I don't know why it has a carrot in it food trough which has some flowers and some like grass and horse food <clears throat> and over here we have some special horse medicine some carrots and some some kind of vegetables for each horse we have a pink bucket and a green bucket for each little horse so here's one of the horses here's a horse that has that can fly getting that out of the frame she can fly and she also has a wagon if you can see so she can also carry this wagon you can attach it to her i made it myself and yes it's very cool i will show you the family in it later and we just ran over something oh well 
Okay. So, let's put the horse back inside the little house. Here is my husband. Just move over. Thank you. Stand there for a second. Nope, just fall over. Okay. So, this is my other horse with its special saddle. It's a white and pink, a purple, sorry, one. He's very lovely. Now, you can go back in and see thing. You can go back in its little, well, its little shed. My husband can keep feeding it. If he can stand up. Okay. On to the next area. I am not outside but indoors now. So this is my room. And if you can see, there's a couple of pets in here. So, I have my little bear that I talked about before. If it will focus, there we go. Oop, fell over, it's fine. Little chinchilla. Focus, please, okay. And a dolphin, which is in my spa. So we have a green bucket. It has fish in it, so the dolphin can eat it. Yum, yum, yum. And it's wearing a party hat, because it likes to wear a party hat. And I have some flowers in uh, this little area. So that little seashell thing is the bear's bed. So the bear sleeps in there, and this is my pet. These three pets are mine, and not my kids, and they're very cute. Yes. There's my bed. I share it with my husband. And those are two cots for my kids with two little baby bottles and a little basket with some crystals in it. And there's just my, some of my mannequins and my messing around stuff. Just a couple bottles, some hats, a TV. Oh, and this is one of my favorite pits. Little window. Close the window. So that's my room my sleep in and this is like the pet playground area and with a little pet bottle <laughs> and uh this is just my spa and my beauty area so a little chair a life jacket is up here there the life jacket if you can see uh we have a little weird dangly thingy a hairbrush Mirror and a little drawer that has what do we have in here? If we can get out, oh, and some lipstick. Now we'll close that. So that's my bathroom, and I don't have a toilet in my house, which is a big mistake. Oh, and that's just one of my chinchilla food balls. So I have three different types of doors to my little private patio. So I have a door for myself and my husband, a little door for my bear, another doggy door, and a little door for my chinchilla. And in the pool, I have a little crabby, because why not have a crab in your pool? That's why we have floaties. Oop. Focus. Okay, so we have this, these two yellow floaties which we use, but we're just hanging them up right now. And we have this little chair floaty with a life jacket in there. And we've lost the top of our umbrella, so we don't know where that's gone. <clears throat> so that's my room. Here's a quick overview. Cots again, and me. Let's go to the next room. Now this next room looks kind of strange, so. <laughs> This is for my daughters. So this is my daughter Sienna's little thing, hairbrush, and her one of her wigs, her seat. And he, here are her outfits and her like mannequin thingies and a little shelf. And this is Natasha's side. Her shelf, her outfits, a little chair, a wand, a gun, a hairbrush, 
a little hat to go um, go kart riding and horse riding. And that's the wardrobe. Next room. Now, the next room is very close to us. So let's just pop by. Three, two, one. In this room, we have someone very special. It's right here. Nana! Nana is reading a book and she is not reading, and the book is, well, like the size of her. And here are some bear beds and a little chinchilla bed. A little pet play area, a little slide, a little seating area. Well, this is Nana's room and she's sitting on her bed reading. Next room! Three, two, one. Now that's quick. So, this is the girls' room, and there's a lot to do in this room. So, it's a bit of a confusing room, and you'll see the puppies in this room. They're kind of hidden right now, but if you look to the side, they're there. Oh. Let's see. Here's one of the puppies. Okay, let's show. So, this is Natasha's TV, and that's Sienna's TV. And um, they, this is Sienna's bed, and this is Natasha's bed. So they have two sleepover beds each, just in case they have a friend who comes over, or something like that. So here's Sienna's sleepover bed, and this is Natasha's sleepover bed. And on Natasha's side, she has two pink windows which open up and they close and two pink flags. And Natasha's colour are pink and yellow. Sienna's colours are blue, white and purple. Same with and her colours and Natasha's colours are also white too. So, so if we lift this bed up, if we can... We probably can't, but on this side, if you have a look, there's a little doggy flap for the dogs. So, yeah. So the dogs can get out. Oh, wait. Here. This is a little doggy cot thing. This is Natasha's little puppy. Which is very cute. Just cover it up. And the dog can come out through the doggy flap, so she's not trapped in there. She just, that's just her little bed. So this is Sienna's bed. So let's just open this up. Sorry about my bracelets in the way of everything. Sienna's sleepover bed, her TV. That's what it says on her TV. She likes mermaids. Oh, and in her room she has, oh, her puppy is a little poodle. His little collar on her, and it has a, and she has a little stick to fetch. So let's just put that back on there, and we're stuck. Okay, there we go. And Sienna also has a little window, which also opens and closes. And Nana fell down. So that's the girls' room. That's the whole house. There's everything. And very sorry about the background noises in the video. And this is just a quick overview of the house. Here are the girls in the spa again. Oh, I said they were my friends before. They're actually being daughters. And they will be in the video. Oh, and we have some special, special footage of the Christmas tree. So the Christmas tree does light up, it changes colour and it's very pretty. Okay, so now we're going to go on to the dragons. Yes, we do have dragons. And then after we're going to go see the, well, the little wagon we have. Be right back. This is me. I'm on my dragon. Ready? There we go. Now you can see that my dragon is quite big and it's a double seater. So there's two saddles, which means 
we can, me and my husband can ride on the dragon. This is how big it is. I also, ha I have two dragons. So, I'll show you the other one. But mine, this one's a, dra a water dragon. It's very pretty. I mean, a fire dragon. Yeah, fire dragon. And I have another water dragon. Um, and it has lovely giant wings. And this one's much bigger compared to my other one. So, let's show you my other one. Hello, I'm on my other blue dragon. Well, this is not my dragon. This is my kid's dragon. Sienna and Natasha's dragon, they like to share. Well, they try to share anyways. And we've lost its tail somehow. But it's still a very pretty dragon with a party hat on. And it's only one cedar. So they have to share. Sometimes one would stand on the tail and remove a little piece. It could stand on the table and one would be riding it. That's what they love to do. And I'm just about to fall off the dragon. Now here's the other dragon. So she is. And it's much bigger than that one. It's a pretty big size difference. If I move it over here, you could probably see it. Here's the size difference. So that one's the blue one before, and there's me. And then there's the one I was writing. So yes. And they're very lovely dragon. Sorry for the bad quality. One of the girl's friends are riding the... Pegasus, while we are in the, all in the dragon, and there's Nana, me, my husband, my daughters. Let's go! We're going on a trip in my favorite Pegasus, flying through the sky. Little Einsteins, we're going on a trip, watch me nene, watch me whip, tapping through the skies. Little Einstein. Don't get copyrighted. And someone died. Have a nice day, peoples. -na 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 -na. Goodbye. Thank you for watching. And it's very blurry.